Hello people, I am Shreya and I am going to take you on an experiential ride of the Backpack Journalism course which was conducted by the St. Xavier's College Ahmedabad in collaboration with the Market University, Wisconsin, USA. The university team consisted of two professors and four mentors and the Xavier's team was more than happy to have them amongst themselves. The person who made this happen was a dear father Vinayak Jadav, professor of Gujarati literature and journalism. So the training in backpack journalism would definitely benefit our own students because it first of all trains them in many uh, ways which they would not uh, be trained in that way in India and the Xavier's College has always believes in giving the best to its students so we thought of starting Backpack and giving the best to our journalism students and putting them in the forefront uh, as we have a dream that uh, we want to produce a cadre of uh, solid journalists for our country. Uh, we are very happy with Market team in Xavier's and we are very very grateful to Market for being so generous with us in coming all the way from here, investing so much of time and money and being so gracious and I'm sure they also have in turn uh, benefited and enriched themselves from their interaction with Xavier students. Welcome always to market, welcome to India, welcome to Xavier, welcome to Ahmedabad. Thank you. In terms of supporting this particular venture, I look at it more as one concrete way of the two institutions collaborating. St. Xavier's Ahmedabad and Market University, Wisconsin. My long-term view of this particular instance is that ultimately it should yield to degrees being shared between the two universities and we have made a couple of proposals. One degree that we would like to have is a Master's in Journalism. To ensure that the students get the best knowledge from this course, St. Xavier's College set up two labs equipped with the latest technology like voice recorders, cameras, Apple desktops with the latest softwares. The mentors left no stone unturned to give the students the best knowledge regarding this course. And they also guided the students on how to use the equipment so that they know how to make the most of it. Let's hear Dr. Stephen Byers telling us about what made him come to India and teach the students backpack journalism. Well, Marquette's team is over here because Marquette as a school has made a decision that the Indian people and our Indian friends are important to us. Uh, the ties with St. Xavier have uh, gone back several years. And there throughout the university is not just the journalism department, but also business and economics. Uh, various other areas are considering ties as well. Backpack journalism is basically taking all the components that would tell a story visually as well as written. So we're talking audio, we're talking uh, photo, we're talking video. And we're expanding on the written story to help the audience or the end user really become a part of the story instead of just being an inactive reader. After the lectures on journalism started, the 27 students were divided into groups. These groups had been given assignments and tasks which were to be completed within a specific time period. The professors worked actively and endlessly to make sure that the students make the most of the given opportunity and it also inspired the students to participate in all the activities that were assigned to them. Labs were kept open for students after lectures so that they could work on their assignments. Moreover, a special website was also created for this course so that the students could know each other in a better way and also get to showcase their hard work. I think that something that's really important for them to learn is that in the journalism career, it's a very fast-paced business. And it's something that they're all really showing that they're committed to and something that they're all ready for and are waiting and very excited to get into the field. So the students are really showing that they're ready for it and that they're interested in that. 
they can actually, they will succeed and I think their work's going to turn out great. My experience of the program has been positive. It really, it really has. I mean, it's been no surprise to me that the students here have been not much different to those that have been around the world. I've been to various parts of the world. I've studied, I've studied abroad for a year and it's been really, um, I can't really say it, warming to my heart to see that the students here at St. Xavier are not much different to the students in England or France or what have you. It's the same passion for learning, the same passion to do what they need to get further on in life, to get that story of their journalists, to get the perfect shot of their photographers. I think uh, that we from Marquette have learned just as much from all of you as you have learned from us. One thing that I really noticed with uh, the backpack journalism students, especially um, probably students here in India, is their focus and uh, dedication. And that's something that I think that American students can learn from. Um, the American education system is all over the place sometimes. And here, students pick what they want and pursue it, and they love it, and that's something I really admire. And, and I know they, have probably learned that being on time is important. At least I hope they do. And I hope they stick to that and um, continue it in whatever they accomplish as life goes on. This course has been an absolutely perfect amalgamation of not only their culture with our culture, but also their way of studying with our way of studying. And it's just been a fantastic experience for the past two weeks. And uh, I hope that I can have similar experiences with the market people in years to come. The Backpack Journalism course it was a very learning experience for us. We got, to, uh, we got to use a variety of equipment and we got to broaden our vision. Backpack journalism is one course and I'm glad I took it. I think I should recommend it to everyone because it, just not, it is not just limited to journalism but can be applied to every field of your professional life.